Well, hello everyone, and here with another Throwback Thursday review in the rotation of which leads us to a Bionicle one. And today we'll be covering the Godok, Kodok and Godok set from 2002. And of course, so to start things off is uh, with this one, which I think is probably Godok, because Blue, Ga, Ga, Koro, Golly, whatever. And if it's the opposite, tell in the comments. So, of how proportional they are is kind of like two Tyrannosaurus Rexes, of course, which they also did with the uh, Skirmix sets in 2009. And of course, anyways, as for the feet of which, do use both of the Borak feet and also the shields of the brown Borak, but in blue at, or in red as well. And the legs of which are mostly the these older style uh, ratcheted joints used on like the Exotoa set from this time. But it's kind of like turn in and out, of course. And the upper body or on the main body part do have the like regular Borak uh body pieces of course as well as the arm and limb pe leg pieces as well but in the toamata are or at least throwback shoulders but still used in this color at this time probably the only time they reused them in this color and do have the borak to teeth used for claws kind of also pterosaurus like but yeah and of course as for the tail of which done kind of like the tarakava spines where of course they have some tubing around it compared to like rounded bricks just to give you a good feel so which is for the feature of it so the main feature is hold it like this and you pull it and it comes swinging forward like so it's great but since of how these are like the Borak queens, and as how the Boraks of which did have the like eject the head forward feature, well, this is kind of similar to that, but in a larger scale. And for the head of which, also does use some similar parts, like do have those regular eye piece teeth pieces, well, which stays on both of them. And the teeth of which do have the like two long uh, pins, but in white. Probably one of the only times they've ever used that. Well, since like Technic Darth Vader as well. As well as the Onua Claw in, in white as well. And do have that larger gear on there, which also is used on Zidorak in 2005 as well. You can see a couple of antennas in there, which are a pair of flex tubes as well. But that's about it with Kod Gada and for Kodak here, of which just about the same, but instead of antennas, it's the fin pieces for some reason. Which one of the only time seeing them outside of that old dinosaur line from 2001, and just like that, same feature, of course. So, with the feature is. Once you like pull this thing out from underneath it, it becomes still. But once you like pull this down and you can slide it back in, of course. So another one of them hit it features. So instead of like hit a mask off, instead it's just pull it out from it. And do it like so. Come on. Well, sometimes these can kind of get caught. All right, well. So for the verdict on these, well, as for the color schemes of which, being like one, blue with accents of white and all, and the other 
red with accents of white not so perfect for a fourth of july if you know, or any occasion like that yeah, but yeah and so overall a pretty cool set from the time at least nice to have a leader have leader sets of which kind of like the crystal king from the 2009 power miners line and yeah So we also do make a neat alt combiner build as well, like the other Rockies. So probably the only time reusing this idea in the 2002 line from 2001. And yeah. And if you but if you still have these sets from back at the time, well, I hope you had some good memories of them. And yeah. And if you missed out on these and still have access to them, I say go ahead and get them like eBay, BrickLink, whatever. And that's about it for this video, and thanks for watching.